Think you know what this skin lesion is? Take a minute to pause the video before we get to the correct answer. If you guessed acne vulgaris, you are correct. Acne vulgaris, also known as acne or agne, however you prefer to call it, is a common condition that often affects adolescents, although it can also affect adults. Acne actually involves the hair follicle as well as the sebaceous glands, which produce sebum, and there are different types, which we will cover right now. Let's start with comedonal acne, which consists of your whiteheads and your blackheads. Blackheads are due to open comedones that are black because of oxidized melanin. And whiteheads are your closed comedones, and this is where the follicle is completely blocked. Next is your papulopustular acne, and this is where you have papules or your small red bumps, and your pustules, which are really those red bumps that are white or yellow because they're filled with pus. These are the ones that we often squeeze when we shouldn't. And finally, we have our more severe form of acne, or your nodulocystic acne. Nodules are larger, deeper bumps compared to papules, and your cysts are similar to nodules except that they're pus-filled, whereas nodules are solid-filled. This type of acne typically leads to scarring. 